Hello everyone, this tutorial introduces the QSAR Toolbox repository and demonstrates how to install a plugin. The QSAR Toolbox repository is a public platform that makes available toolbox plugins to install additional components such as profilers and in silico models that are not included in the toolbox standard installation. The repository was established for two reasons, to limit the size of the standard installation and to give third parties a possibility to contribute to the toolbox project with their own plugins. Any registered toolbox user is able to upload their developed plugin to the repository. Once uploaded, it goes through technical and documental checks before becoming public. All currently available plugins could be seen at the starting web page of the repository. The plugins can be filtered by a selected category. Currently, there are some plugins for various toolbox profilers, plugins for QSAR models and also a plugin allowing unlocking of the toolbox database compiling the non-confidential substance data that is submitted to the European Chemical Agency. Information for the toolbox supported version, provider, number of downloads, rating, and a short description is available for each plugin. This tutorial demonstrates how to install the unlocking plugin for the respective database. This database has some restrictions regarding export of chemicals or data. In fact, data from the database are not included in toolbox reports and exports unless the unlock plugin is installed. The restrictions are necessary to ensure that the data are not used outside their terms and conditions. When users install the unlock plugin, they have to accept the same terms and conditions applicable for the study result database available on the European Chemicals Agency website. After that, Toolbox will include in its reports and exports the same fields that are also available in the respective study results. Let's install the unlock plugin. To do that, close the Toolbox server and client if they are running on your computer. Then, use the search to find the repository client and open it. When the Toolbox repository client is opened, first you have to go to the Options tab where you must specify your login details. These are the same details that you are using to download the Toolbox software. Then, go to the Available tab where all of the modules that the current Toolbox version supports will be listed. If you do not see any module, click Check Now button. The next step is to select the toolbox components of interest. One or more than one component could be selected. Let's select the unlock plugin and one of the profilers, for example, oral absorption. Now click on download now and install after restart button. A new window with the terms and conditions for usage of the respective database will appear. Read carefully and check the box if you agree with them. Then click continue. The selected plugins will be automatically installed. Close the repository client and start Toolbox. Now, Toolbox will include data from this database in its reports and exports. The installed profiler will be available in the list with the other profilers. Congratulations! Now you become familiar with the Toolbox repository and you know how to install other Toolbox components of interest. If you want to know more about Toolbox, watch the other video tutorials.